following a story out of North Charleston tonight, a North Charleston high school teacher reportedly hearing a pop while inside a classroom and then smelling gunpowder. A gun found in a nearby parking lot not long after a student taken to the hospital. News 2 Sophia Arizosa spent the afternoon at North Charleston High School and shares why some say this incident should not define the student body. A gun discharged in class. I think it's a little surprising to, to hear news like this. Moments later, a student found with a gunshot wound to the leg walking along East Montague Avenue. It's a little unnerving that one might have been brought into a classroom so close to all, you know, all of these businesses and around other kids in the school. Police telling us it was self-inflicted. The Charleston County School District saying the gun discharged accidentally while in the student's possession. It's unfortunate to hear that one of the students might have um, made a really poor choice today. The student detained and taken to the hospital. The gun found in a nearby parking lot. One kid comes in, hopefully made a mistake, and you know we just don't want to penalize everybody else for that. Joan Lesky is the wife of North Charleston High School's football coach. We just want to just not let this cause anything negative in the community. And a proud supporter of the Cougars. We love these kids, we love the school, and there's great teachers, there's a great new principal. She says this incident. Was it right? No. Misrepresents the school. I still don't want it to be a negative thing on us. Charleston, Charleston County Schools sent this statement saying in part the student per federal law and the Charleston County School District Code of Conduct can be expelled for no less than 365 days for this action. They went on to say North Charleston and CCSD officials take this matter seriously and a proper and thorough review of this incident and safety procedures will be conducted.